good day friends in this lecture we will be seeing how the electrical machines are classified electrical machines are classified into two broad major types one is rotating machine other one is a static machine by rotating machine as the name says it has moving parts by static machine the name says it doesn't have any moving part for example transformers they are static machines they do not have any moving parts and rotating machines have moving parts and in every rotating machine there is going to be a stator and a rotor the rotor is a part which is a moving one rotating machines are classified into three major categories dc machines ac machines and special machines dc machines are direct current machines ac machines are alternating current machines special machines work based on the supply given to it dc machines can be further classified as a dc motor or a dc generator motors generally convert electrical energy to mechanical energy generators convert mechanical energy to electrical energy so by a machine we mean a motor or a generator so dc machine can be a motor or a dc generator similarly ac machines can be ac motors or ac generators under ac machines we have two broad classification one is synchronous machines other one induction machines synchronous machine the name says as the name says synchronous means they are constant speed machines induction machines are variable speed machines again here synchronous machines can be either synchronous motors or synchronous generators the synchronous generators are also the alternators which are mainly used to produce electrical energy for the uh, consumers most of the power stations will have the alternators it is used in the generation side of a uh, electrical power system induction motors can again be induction motors or induction generators induction motors are the ones very very widely used under induction motors we have single phase induction motors and three phase induction motors single phase induction motors are the ones which are being used in the domestic applications three phase induction motors are used in industrial applications mostly induction generators are used for specific applications only the special machines are the machines which work for the particular application there are many types of special machines to quote a few stepper motor a motor which moves in steps example the motor which is used in the wall clock it moves one step for a input given to it servo motors are the ones which are mostly used in robotics bltc motors are the ones which are used nowadays in electric vehicles permanent magnet synchronous motors which are again used in electric vehicles nowadays switch reluctance motors are also used for some applications so a broad classification of the electric machines is given in this lecture thank you